What's going on everybody? Um, I just want to thank all of you for just being so amazing and so insightful at the door. As I'm canvassing, I'm meeting neighbors and people that live in my area for as long as I have. I learn history lessons and I learn stories and I connect with old schoolmates and all kinds of fun stuff. It's been great. As one neighbor said, there's a continuity of community that happens when you see one generation raise their kids the next generation buys their house, their kids go to the school that their kids went to, and so it goes on. So that made me think, what makes for a continuity of community? And it has to be a place that's attractive, a place that's taking care of itself in terms of property taxes and the money's going to proper services and infrastructure, and a sense of safety. People leave when they don't feel safe. People leave when it's not attractive. So that attractiveness and that community safety are things that tie into what I call a continuity of community. So I'm so grateful for that term from our neighbors at the door. And as we continue to grow in this area, I'm trying to stay focused on that as I address issues that come up. What do we do so that the next generation feels that this is a great place to live, grow and raise their family? Let all of my decisions be based on the fact that I want that continuity and that people would feel that the next generation can enjoy this place, that young people can, be, can grow up and feel like they want to buy a house in the area where their parents bought a house. So as I'm answering questions at people's doors and thinking about what it looks like when I'm in city council, everything comes back to that continuity. What does the next generation need? How is that informing the decisions I make today? How do we learn and grow as a community? Some food for thought as we go through our day. Thanks for watching Martin Reed Mississauga. Like, subscribe, and share for more content, and check out martinreed.ca to contribute with your time, your money, and your vote to this campaign.